know how the human body replenishes and repairs itself? Every day, 300 billion old or damaged cells die and are eliminated from our body and need to be replenished or repaired. Stem cells play a fundamental role in our body's need for repair and renewal. Unlike other cells in our body, a stem cell has the unique ability to differentiate itself into other types of cells. These other cells are specialized and have a specific function. For example, intestinal cells are responsible for nutrient absorption. Let's talk about the history of scientific studies on stem cells. At the beginning of the century, it was thought that stem cells could only differentiate into specific blood cells such as platelets, red blood cells, or white blood cells. Several scientific studies published since that time demonstrated an important discovery. Stem cells from the bone marrow or adult stem cells can migrate and differentiate into almost any type of cell in the body. The second essential fact is that adult stem cells have the ability to self-renew and provide a constant supply of stem cells in the bone marrow. In 2002, a published scientific hypothesis was later validated by hundreds of studies. These studies concluded that adult stem cells constitute the natural repair and renewal system of the human body. This was a major and revolutionary scientific discovery. Okay, but how does it work? When a tissue or organ is damaged, it will secrete a first set of specific signaling compounds into the blood and these compounds will circulate to the bone marrow. These specific compounds signal and trigger the release of stem cells in the blood. And during the next few days, a significant increase in the number of circulating stem cells is observed. Initially, the stem cells do not have a direction. To help them navigate, the affected tissue releases a second set of compounds, which will attract and guide the stem cells to the area in need of repair. When the stem cells connect with the signaling compounds in the capillaries and microvessels of the damaged tissue, the stem cells migrate into the tissue and begin multiplying and differentiating into the specific tissue for its repair and renewal. Stem cells not only repair damaged tissue every day, but on a smaller scale circulate throughout the body to renew and replenish old and dying cells to support optimum health. It is through this mechanism of action that stem cells are considered responsible for the natural repair and renewal system of the entire human body. Therefore, it appears that the correlation between the greater the number of circulating stem cells and the body's ability for self-repair and recovery is directly related. In fact, it has been shown that people who release a large number of circulating stem cells after a stroke have a better recovery and a better post-stroke clinical recovery. In addition, several studies have shown that people with more circulating stem cells had fewer cardiovascular events and a lower death rate related to cardiovascular issues. Increasing the number of stem cells circulating in the body optimizes the ability of tissue repair. There are two solutions to achieve this. First solution, a physician obtains a sample of a patient's stem cells, cultivates them in the laboratory, and re-injects the cells into the patient. A second and more natural preventative is to increase the release of our own stem cells in the body. This is called the mobilization of endogenous stem cells. In summary, there are three complementary and essential steps necessary for repair and renewal. One the release of stem cells from the bone marrow. Two, stem cell circulation in the blood. Three, migration into the affected tissue. The benefits of the two methods have been demonstrated in hundreds of publications on a variety of conditions. In conclusion, like the circulatory system, the digestive system, or the respiratory system, promoting good health and the survival of the entire body 
stem cells are recognized as a new fundamental system of the human body. Therefore, supporting the natural role of adult stem cells contributes to overall health maintenance.